Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, my name is Audrey. And today I have for y'all another Shein haul. So a huge thank you to Shein for providing the clothes for me today. I love working with them, y'all know I do. And I know y'all enjoy my Shein hauls too. So like always, there will be a coupon code in the description box down below. But if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to let you know when I upload a new video. And let's go ahead and get started. take a look at the clothes I just wanted to remind y'all that everything you need will be in the description box down below so that tiny little arrow beside the title of this video just go to that click it and hit more usually you have to hit more for everything to drop down but I include my measurements the sizes I got the links everything that you need including makeup the gear I use the steamer everything I use is gonna be linked down below but before we take a look at the clothes I just wanted to tell y'all thank you so much for your patience and some of y'all have reached out to me to make sure everything's okay because there's been a little bit of time between my last video and now and all it is is that we're a little short staffed at work and so my work schedule kind of went a little crazy this past week so, <laughs> so those 10 hour days start to creep up on you so I just wanted to tell y'all thank you so much for your patience and your understanding. I love doing this and I hate not being able to film. I have so much stuff here waiting for me to film. I just, you know, life. Life happens and <laughs> you just have to go with it. So we're going to go ahead and get started on the clothes, but I just wanted to tell y'all thank you so, so much for being so understanding and so kind about the delay. So we are going to go ahead and get started. So like always, I'm going to have the picture of the items on, from online here, a picture of me in it, and then the trial portion that I filmed outside will be playing right over here. So I have been including the price, just so y'all know that price is without any kind of coupon codes or anything. I do have my own coupon code that you can use, but I just like to give y'all an idea of how much stuff costs. So the price I'm going to put up for these pieces are the original price without any discounts or sales, just so y'all know. So the first piece that we're going to look at is this really cute little tank peplum. Look at this. So I went with the 3XL on this one and it's 100% polyester. This one does come in a couple of different colors. Got to be honest with you, I'm probably going to get a few more because even though in my mind I'm starting to shift toward fall or autumn, depending on where you are, um, I am an autumn baby. I'm a fall baby. I love it. So it's like my heart is starting to push that way, <laughs> even though we have a ways to go. I'm not going to push it too fast, but I'm ready. So again, a 3XL, 100% polyester. And the really neat thing about this is it's a solid strap. So it's just a pure strap, just like a tank top. And then you have the bow attached. So, so this piece, the bow is not holding the strap the straps together, thankfully, because I have a dress in this haul that I was struggling because the only thing holding up are the little straps you have to tie. So, oh, there's there's our girl. So, <laughs> the other one's asleep, I think, under the bed, I believe. But, um, love, love, love these little bows. I love this. It kind of reminds me of a candy striper. It's just so cute. A little bit on the thin side. You can probably see in the trial part, you can see where my jeans start. So if you don't like that, you could always put a little camisole underneath it and it would be fine. You have an elastic waistband here. A little bit of stretch. Nothing too, too crazy. And then you have that really cute flare at the bottom, the little peplum. So I did pair this with some pull-on flare jeans. I will try to find them. I wear them a lot on here and in real life. I love them. They're just the best. I think they may still be available. So I will try to find them and put them up for y'all. But I love this. And I did have somebody say that you shouldn't wear peplums with flares, that you should wear peplum tops with skinny jeans. I get that that it's the shape that some people like that slender shape and then the peplum only. I personally think it looks good both ways, but there's something about a peplum with flares that I just love and I always am. But everybody likes things differently, so to each their own. But me personally, I love the silhouette of that peplum and then the flare. I just think it, I don't know, I think it looks good and I like it. So, I, you know, wear it however you want to. These, this would be really, really cute with some white 
skinny capris or jeans. It would be cute with a lot of different things. I personally, I'm a flare girl and I love it and I'll wear it how I want to. <laughs> so now the next look that I came up with, I got this ruffly sleeveless tee and this one I went with the 3XL and it's a polyester elastane mix. I really, really like this top, but I'm just going to go ahead and tell you the fabric may be a little bit troublesome for some of y'all just because I'm going to try to show it to you. I don't know if y'all can see the texture of it. It feels a little bit like swimsuit material, but the good thing is for it to be a 3X in this fabric, it's not too clingy. It doesn't hug every little roll and ripple because <laughs> I got them, but it's just really comfortable. So I know a lot of time textures are a little bit a little bit of a, a hang up for people. So I really like to describe the fabric as best I can because a lot of people may be turned off by this fabric, but it doesn't bother me. It actually feels like it kind of holds you in a little bit without being, you know, showing everything. It's really hard to explain, but it does have that swimsuit feel to it. It's not shiny. It just has that kind of texture to it but really, really comfortable. And I think it looked really good untucked, me personally, with these black flares that we're gonna talk about in a second. But you could also tuck it in if you wanted to. I think it could go either way. I do show it in the trial and part both ways. I think though I like this one in particular untucked just because of the fit of it. I don't know. I. Y'all decide whichever way y'all want to do it, but I really like this one untucked, but again, you do have options with it. Love the little ruffles. You have double ruffle, one right here, one here, and the good thing about this one, the armhole isn't extremely big, so I don't think that you would really have to layer anything under this other than your bra. Just keep in mind the material. You know, it is what it is, but I actually really like it, and it was really hot when I was filming the trial and part of this, and I was actually really comfortable. So, you know, it's not, I don't know, maybe that elastane kind of saved it a little bit from being too hot or too unbreathable, if that's even a word. But, but the bottoms I paired it with, I got these. Now, I'm going to go ahead and tell you, y'all can hear Shein's buttons are not all, are not the best. I think we've pretty much established that. They're usually a little bit like that. <laughs> but I'm gonna tell you, I wear their jeans almost every day to work. I love flare jeans. I have some black flares very similar to these. And at work, cause I, y'all know I work at Sephora. We have our black t-shirt and a lanyard and all this other stuff we have to wear. And you have to wear black bottoms. It doesn't matter what it is. I love flares, so I usually wear Shein flares or the Sofia Vergara skinnier jeans from Walmart. But y'all, I love Shein jeans, even though the button is questionable. <laughs> I wonder sometimes if it's gonna go flying across the room, but so far so good, I have not had that issue. So now I have this pair of flares here. They are a little bit higher waisted than the ones I wear to work. So I'm kind of excited about that because I, I like high waisted stuff. I feel like it holds you in, you know? So these are 71% cotton, 27 polyester, and 2% elastane. And I went with the 4XL. I typically go with a 4XL in Shein jeans if they have a lot of stretch. These were high stretch, so I always do a 4XL in high stretch. If they don't and they offer 5XL, I'll go with that. So it's all about the stretch, high stretch, 4XL for me. And again, my measurements are in the description box below. So you have regular pockets on the front and the back. You have flares and they do have that unfinished hem, which is fine. Wear some flares a couple of days. They're gonna be unfinished anyway, cause they drag the ground. <laughs> but very, very stretchy, really comfortable. Love these jeans. So I'm kinda excited to have another pair of black flares that I can wear to work because y'all mine, they're starting to wear in the thighs, y'all. That is awful. <laughs> I get rid of more jeans because of the thighs than anything else because it just wore down to nothing by the time I get rid of them. But I do love their flare jeans. That just a huge win for me. And I loved them with the black and white shirt. So I also got another shirt that I paired with those same flare jeans and it is another peplum and flare combo. So I went with this one and it is a 3XL 100% polyester. Now, full disclosure, this one is 100% polyester, like I said, but it is 
rough like not it doesn't irritate your skin but the feel of it I don't I hope y'all can see if you can see the texture you might know exactly what I'm talking about let me see if it'll zoom in do you see that texture it almost has this canvas type texture to it it and it's it I don't know it's really it's not silky at all like it looks like it would be because you have that you know the little flutter sleeves and you have the peplum this is a stiff fabric it feels like I starched the full out of it and ironed it that's what this feels like very very stiff fabric but a beautiful print and it's not uncomfortable it's just unexpected you know, I, I wasn't, when I, I knew it was going to be polyester, knew that, but when I took it out of the package, I was like, it's a little scruffy. <laughs> so, but it is really cute. So you got your v-neck, your flutter sleeve, the elastic at the waist, all the way around the waist and the back. I love the print, the pattern. I love the colors and I loved it with the flare jeans. Y'all, I'm on a Petlum flare jean kick. Love it, love it, love it. It's just the fabric is not the best in the world. <laughs> I mean, I'm used to like the silky polyester or the staticky polyester or the really hot polyester. This is kind of a first for me and I, I thought I knew all of their fabrics at this point, but that one, it, it feels like it should be canvas, you know, like a canvas bag. Like that's how it feels. <laughs> That's how it feels. So I don't know what kind of sorcery they used on that shirt, but mm, I don't know. It's not a huge loss for me. I can deal with it and maybe with a good washing and some, you know, some fabric softener, you maybe could soften it up a little bit, but just be fully aware. It is not silky. It's not soft. It's not flowy. It's a very stiff, stiff fabric. And now the next look, I'm going to go ahead and tell you, I have been trying to find these pants forever. <laughs> well, we'll talk about the top first. We're going to talk about the top first. It's the exact same bodysuit as the one that I have on, but it's black. So again, everything will be linked down below. I will tell you this one, the fabric is very clingy. So I went with the 4XL in this one and the fabric is 9% elastane, 91% polyester. It's a little clingy. Um, I think you can tell in the when I'm showing the try on part that it does kind of show like where my bra starts and my boobie is. Um, <laughs> this bra is a little tight. So I think, you know, with a different bra, it would have been fine, but it's a very clingy fabric almost like almost like workout type stuff i don't work out but kind of like that like you know the the sports bras and the leggings and all that stuff the stuff y'all work out in that's what this feels like but again i went with a 4xl this one is short sleeves traditional bodysuit so you got the three snap closure here i have on the white one too and it's really comfortable like it's really really comfortable but I do have one that's more of a cotton blend that I would prefer to wear with these particular pants and we're gonna talk about those in a second because I'm obsessed with these pants but this is really really nice again very silky very soft stretchy stretchy the hip doesn't come up too high so you could really wear low-rise stuff whatever you want to with these they're very very comfortable i'm loving these to just wear around the house and i love body suits i am so happy that i finally warmed up to them about a year and a half ago and i'm just loving them i love body suits but really good basic piece to have but i don't i don't really care for it with these particular pants that we are about to talk about so the reason that i've been on the hunt for these particular type of pants is this. So I'm going to put her picture up here. My girl, my heart, love, love, love. So Marilyn Monroe's favorite pants, I mean, it's been documented. They were her favorite things that she owned were these black and white checkered pants. And she wore them all the time. Any, any candid photos you can find of her, you will always come across these pants. There, she just loved them. So she, I think she had two different kinds, but I do have some dress pants in the same pattern and I will bring them out in the winter time or when it gets a little bit cooler. I came across them the other day and tried them on. 
perfect. So <laughs> I'm just happy to have those. But for these, y'all, the Shein Fit Plus line that they just came out with when I was scrolling through some of their stuff because I mentioned previously that their Fit Plus goes up to a size, I believe 30. A I believe it's 30 or 32, somewhere around there. And they start at the US 22. So I am right on the I'm at the smallest size of their Fit Plus line, and I got a dress and a few other pieces. They were way too big for the 20, in the 22, so very generous sizing in their Fit Plus. So if you've been out, kind of out of the sizing on their regular plus size, you may want to look at Fit Plus. The proportions are beautiful, absolutely beautiful. So these are part of that Fit Plus. And I left the tag on it just so y'all could see the difference. So you get this little hang tag on it with their Fit Plus and it just says, Shein Fit Plus provides trendy clothing made thoughtfully to fit a multitude of plus size body, plus body sizes and types. So I'm, I'm gonna take this off cause you know, I'm keeping these cause they're gorgeous. Um, <laughs> so I went with the US 22. Their tag is a little bit different too. So it's got the Shein Fit Plus US 22 here. And these are 20% cotton, 76% polyester, 4% viscose. So these are just your traditional pull-on black and white checked pants. You have pockets in the front and you have the drawstring here. It does function, so it goes all the way around. It's They're just beautifully beautifully made and this fit plus line again this is the smallest size that they come in the thighs the booty the belly whoever came up with this line knows plus size bodies because y'all know typical Shein plus size pants can be troublesome I do well with their jeans with the high stretch but a lot of their trousers and pants are just it's been a problem. <laughs> so, so for them to come out with this line, I don't know who is helping them with this, but y'all, these are the best. Really casual and cute. And when I saw them, I just had to have them because the first person I thought about was Marilyn. And y'all, I'm obsessed with these. They are so comfortable. They are, they feel like they feel almost like a linen. They're really, really, really comfortable, but they're textured as y'all can see. They're lightweight, breathable. They have that cotton in there. You've got plenty of stretch in the waist. Y'all, we have options. We have options now and we're only getting more and more and more. So a huge, huge thank you to Shein for these pants because let me tell you, they make me so happy because the fit is perfect. Again, my measurements are linked down below. That will tell you everything you need to know if you want to compare your sizes to mine. Those pants, perfect, 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 perfect. I am so in love with those pants. Now the next look in this haul, I have what I paired this bodysuit with. Again, the 4XL in this one is the polyester last stain. I love this bodysuit. It's just like the black one love 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 just a basic piece it's really really slinky and stretchy and comfortable love this but the skirt that I paired it with so for some of y'all this may be really plain and not too exciting but it is everything to me so I had been looking at this picture online for quite a while but I just didn't know and I looked at the fabric and I was like I don't know I don't know if it's going to be what I want so I just went ahead and went for it and y'all you're going to be seeing this skirt for the rest of the year. <laughs> if y'all follow me on anything, you're going to be seeing this skirt because it's a must have. It feels like you're wearing a pair of sweatpants, but it's a skirt. So for this one, I went with the 3XL and it is 95% polyester, 5% elastane. So what got me is the waistband. Look at this thick waistband and the elastic is sewn all the way through so it's elastic the whole waist is elastic and it is just a flare skirt just a circle skirt and it is everything so it's that gray that heathered gray and here's the underneath this is exactly what Shein's sweatshirts are made out of they're not fleece lined or anything like that but this when you order a sweatshirt from them this is pretty much what it looks like on the inside it's not that thick sweatshirt material but y'all this skirt is amazing 
<laughs> absolute the, the the twirl of it this the feel of it it is everything and i love tucking in a shirt into it it's just the waistband y'all you feel like you could do anything in this thing because it is just perfection i am so happy with this skirt for it to be just such a simple piece i am so so happy with it because i've been like i said i've been looking at it and wondering about it and now that i have it like i can't wait to wear it all the time it is perfect so after i filmed the try on part of this i put this back on with this and i was just walking around the house just living life but <laughs> but i love i love this skirt highly recommend this one just because it's so comfortable and it's just easy you literally just pull it right on and you go you can wear it with wedges like i did you could throw in some little flats or sneakers even because it's basically a sweatshirt material so you could do anything that you want to with it it is just the best skirt ever and y'all know i love my skirts but it's just so comfortable it's like and i forgot to mention it has pockets so you got pockets in here too so win-win all around highly 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 recommend this skirt if you like comfort but you want to look cute too and now on to the dresses it's a denim button front dress and i went with the 4xl in this one and it is 85 percent cotton 15 percent polyester so the issue that i had with this are the straps they're not adjustable as y'all can see they're just straps so they're just a little bit too long so then it makes the bust kind of hang down a little bit i don't know just the fit of this one was off just a hair so I'm thinking now that I have it and I know the fit and the cut of it and everything because I didn't know if it had any stretch in it and the waist does not but I had plenty of room in that way so I would say for this one I need to reorder it in a 3XL so because the straps are just a little bit too long it kind of affects the feel of the whole thing so I do think that by going by going with a 3XL would have been a better choice. So I probably will reorder this because I love the color of it, that light wash. Love the button front because it's a fit and flare. So you don't have to worry about those buttons pulling and all of that. It's just an adorable dress. I mean, I love it. And in the fall, you could even layer it. You could put it on, you could put a white top underneath if you want to just like this you could put a sweater over it if you wanted to a cardigan anything you want to do with it in the summer i think it's really pretty on its own just those straps are just a hair too big so it kind of droops a little bit but i really think that i may order this in the 3xl because i really love the the look of it love the style of it I, and it's really soft it's not a really stiff denim and I think that too is where it's lacking in a little bit of structure is because it is so soft, but not thin. I mean, it's your typical light wash denim, but really, really like it. I just think I need to go down one size. And now for the next dress in this haul, I have this little black and white gingham sundress. I went with the 3XL and it's 100% polyester. I love the look of this dress. I think that it is just absolutely beautiful when you put it on I'll tell you when you take it out of the package the fabric is a little thin just being honest it's that polyester it's not real staticky but it's pretty thin there's not a whole lot to it very lightweight and fluffy and thin but when you put it on and you add the little sash belt that comes with it it just transforms it into just this adorable adorable dress y'all i love this one so you have the faux buttons right here at the bust you've got the strap they are not too long the armholes are not too big you do have an invisible zipper right here on the left side i didn't need those i did i just pulled it on and wiggled it down <laughs> it was perfect really really comfortable not a whole lot of stretch in this so if you're on the fence or if you're right on the line between a size i would say go to the next one unless you are exact but the 3xl for me fit perfectly and when you put the belt on it's just the cutest it's really really cute i don't care that it's a little thin material you can't really see through it because of the print but i am obsessed with this dress i think it's so cute and this one would even transition really easily into the fall 
put on a little Yemak cardigan sweater with this and you are ready. This is the cutest little thing. I love this. I think I have a mustard cardigan that I can pair this with and I think it would be adorable. So, you know, go ahead and get those pieces now that you can transition into, at least in the U.S. I don't know where, every, I don't know what the weather is everywhere else, but for us, you know, we're still right in the thick of summer, but fall will be right around the corner and I can't wait. So now is the time to start getting those really good deals on pieces that are going to start phasing out because y'all know how retail is. Before you know it, they're gonna have sweaters everywhere. So Shein is no different. They're gonna start transitioning soon into the fall stuff. So now is the time to get these little pieces that are summer, but can carry you into fall too. Love this dress, love it. So I have two more pieces left in this haul. Now this dress, unfortunately, is not a win for me. And we're gonna talk about why. So this is the one I was talking about where the straps hold the dress on and I, they're just so silky, I could not, they just kept slipping out, and so I finally had to double knot them, and it still wasn't holding its place, so, <laughs> you know. So for this one, I went with the 3XL, and it's 100% polyester. Now I'm gonna tell you, the color of this is absolutely gorgeous. This is a dreamy, dreamy dress with the ruffles. It's kind of got a handkerchief hem. I am not a fan of handkerchief hems at all. I never have been. I'm never going to be. But this one has a little bit of a little bit of a scallop to it. So it's not that sharp like caught in the lawnmower. Um but it's a beautiful dress from here down. Absolutely beautiful. It's lined. I mean the color, y'all look at the colors and it. it's just beautiful i love the fabric the little ruffles the layering everything about the bottom of this dress i'm obsessed with even that scallop hem it's the top that's the problem <laughs> it's a big problem the issue is there's no shape to the top like there's there's just nothing there at all to with any structure so you've got these straps that hold it on and then you've got this so it kind of reminded me of a 50s prom dress this part right here and I was so excited about it but then you've got these flims this flimsy side here and then you've got the whole back is smocking so there's no structure to it so everything just wants to fold over or hang down or droop to the side and I had on a strapless bra. The strapless bra was perfect. That was the only thing holding anything up was the strapless bra that I had on. I'll link that down below too. Um, I The top of this dress needs structure. There needs to be maybe not the smocking. If that would have just been a solid back and then had the straps to hold it together, it would have been, I think that would have saved it. But everything's too droopy. Like, <laughs> I mean, no matter how tight you tied this, this just kind of like hung over and drooped over. So then it almost looked like underarm. I don't know. It's really hard to explain, but the top of this dress is just kind of a disaster. In my opinion, you would have to tie these straps so, so tight just to even look decent in my opinion. I don't know. I just think it's lacking a lot of structure. But again, y'all, so much potential. This skirt, the coloring, the ruffles, it's well made. And that's what's so disappointing. This dress is so well made. It is fully lined. You can't see through it. It's just the idea is beautiful. But if this had more of a structured top, oh, it would have been in my top pick of this, this whole video. But it doesn't. So there's really nothing more I can say but the color y'all the color is beautiful I don't know how the pictures are going to turn out of me wearing it I just took them just a few minutes ago but I mean uh I really wanted to love this one but the top of it just kind of ruined it for me so I would say that's really the only no in this haul for me I do have one more dress that I want to show y'all and it's an absolute win it's like it's just beautiful but that dress this mint green dress was just gorgeous it just had some structure issues you know but it is a beautiful beautiful the fabric the color the ruffles the hem everything about it the idea is beautiful just it just didn't quite make it for me 
And now for the last piece in this haul and probably my favorite, other than the black and white pants, this is definitely a favorite. So I had actually bought this dress myself um, about a month ago. And when I got it, it was way too tight. I had gone with the 2XL and it was just really tight across the bust and the waist because there's no stretch in the waist or any of it. And so it was just really tight and uncomfortable. So I did return it, I sent it back. And I said, well, if I get the chance, I'll get it again in a 3XL. And I got it again in the 3XL. This one, y'all, <laughs> I'm gonna look like a pumpkin this year because I'm wearing this dress. I wanna go to a pumpkin patch and take pictures in this. I don't know where, there is one here locally that a good friend of mine, you know, we work together, but we've been friends forever. We're talking about going right now, it's sunflowers, but then in the fall, they'll do pumpkins and all that. So I got to wear this dress, y'all. So I went with the 3XL, it's 100% polyester. The fabric, y'all, it feels amazing. It is absolutely gorgeous. So it is a puff sleeve dress. You've got the zipper up the back, elastic at the shoulders and the armholes, not too tight. Very, very comfortable. You've got that fitted waist with the pleating, the seams down the bust, and just a flare dress. This is basically the puff sleeve dress that I've already shown y'all, but this orange. Absolutely beautiful. I am in love with this color. I think this is like one of the happiest colors that you can have. I don't know why. It does look like a pumpkin. It's pretty much Halloween pumpkin, but I don't care because it's just beautiful. The cut of it is so feminine and the color is just perfect. Everything about this dress is beautiful. I've already planned out what I want to do with my hair. I have a whole Pinterest board of ideas of stuff I want to do. Of course, obviously, it's just finding the time to do it. Y'all know, <laughs> working full time and doing this, it, it, you know, and having a husband and two cats and just life, it gets a little bit difficult to prioritize things. But y'all, this dress has to be seen. It is beautiful gorgeous the color is thick but moves really pretty it's flowy but it it's a pretty thick material and so comfortable and this is one of those those moments where you're steaming something and the wrinkles just fall right out and it feels so good like you just accomplish this huge thing it is just beyond beautiful it is perfection but i highly Y'all get this dress, you need this dress, especially with, before you know it, Halloween will be here. And if you wanna look cute and show everybody else up, here's your dress, <laughs> this will do it. It's just absolutely everything to me. So y'all, that is all I have for y'all today in this haul. And I hope that y'all like some of these pieces. I had so much fun putting this together and I've been waiting all week to do it because y'all, I miss doing this. It's been like eight days, I think, since I put up a video, and I miss y'all when, when I'm not here. I miss doing this. I love, love, love it, but y'all know how this goes. You know, you, you got a job, and you got to do it, and you know, you just do the best you can with what you got and the time you have. So, I hope that this haul makes up for my absence a little bit. I do have to film another haul after this one, <laughs> but I'm going to fix something and then I'm going to film it. So, I hope that y'all enjoyed this video. I hope that y'all like it, share it, whatever. I'm getting really close to 20,000 subscribers and that's a huge, huge deal to me. I know it may not sound like much to, you know, for some channels, but for me, that's a big, big deal. So a massive thank you to every single one of y'all, your support, your kindness. I mean, it means everything to me. I mean, I couldn't ask for a better better group of people in my little community. So huge thank you to y'all for being here and spending your time with me and coming back to my channel every time. So I really do appreciate y'all. And y'all, until next time, take care of yourselves and take care of each other. And I will see you soon.